Hello everyone, Ace here, and today we are back with another example of Xbox emulation, courtesy of Zemu. And today the game we are testing out is none other than Halo 2. So let's go ahead and see how it runs, shall we? I'll just set it to full screen. As you can tell, the menu screen itself has some frame rate issues. But if we select level and go to Cairo Station, we'll go to normal, and this will give you an idea of what the game's like. So, let's go ahead and give it a try. It might take us a little while for it to load in, but once we're in, you should be able to see how exactly the game runs. And I have actually had a little bit of time, not too much, but a little bit to test it out. All right, so as you can tell, there is some frame rate issues right off the bat. Uh, there's also some texture issues as well for some of the character models. And some of the weapons, as you can tell, the battle rifle uh, texture is a little bit off. And the Marines here, their heads are a little bit badly textured. But that's not the big problem. Also, some of the objects here, the textures don't render. But the big problem with the emulation at this point, there's two things you'll notice missing. Well, actually three. Actually four, now that I think about it. The UI, the only thing from the UI you can actually see right now is the ammo counter. And not even for the magazines. So your shields are missing, your crosshairs are missing, your magazine themselves are missing and your motion tracker is missing which is enough I think to say this game is not quite ready yet but so as you can tell which is quite a bit of a problem when your shields do inevitably run out as well Time to fall back. I'll let the Marines go forward just so I can heal up, and there we go. But yeah, for a game with the regenerating health as a core mechanic, not knowing how much health you have left is a bit of a problem. <laughs> and that's easily the biggest issue with this emulation right now. So now that we've deleted those, we'll advance maybe a little bit further. But I think you've seen everything needs to be seen at this point. I guess I'll just keep going until I die. Still, it is nevertheless excellent that the game has, emulation has improved to this point. So yeah, I think, I think this is a good stopping point. There are frame rate issues, but it's not, that's not the main problem. It is mainly the EUI that is the big issue right now with this emulation. But otherwise, yeah, let's go ahead and exit out. So that is how Halo 2 more or less runs on Zemu presently. Like I said, it is impressive that it's made, the, made it to this point, but I do think more improvements need to be made before it's really ready. It sounds like a weird thing to need that much for the UI, as there are a few other cues to when you're low on health, sure, and when you're recharging, but for a game which is built around regenerating health, you kind of need to know just exactly how much you have at any given point, in my opinion. So I do think you, it, people should wait until that is implemented properly. But otherwise, it is showing very real promise. 
Anyways, though, this has been Ace. Hope to see you guys again soon. Take care. Ace out. Oh.